delay. <laughs> wow, I actually really like that. It's incredible. Hello, Chip Tippers, and welcome to another episode of Lady Fractic Plays, Lady Fractic Builds, Lady Fractic Does. Today, we have this incredible kit from Fantasy Bricks, and this pays homage to their incredibly successful video game and TV show, Chinese Paladin, also known as The Legend of the Sword and Fairy. There were several video games and several seasons of a Chinese drama that actually looks very impressive. They're having their 28th year anniversary, and so here we are. Now there's several different versions that we can do. They have lots of scenes from the show. I am not as familiar with the show, which hopefully some of you are. So we're gonna make the classic Windows 98 PC. As you can see, this is very big. All right, and this is a pretty cool shot too. Obviously it's bags one through four and then bags five through 10. Here's some cool photos. It reminds me of Street Fighter and Avatar The Last Airbender. She reminds me of Toph. Let's see. Here are all the different characters portrayed on the show. This is the aunt that he is trying to save. There's like the love of his life. Fantasy Brick was established in August of 2020. Their vision is to create a new generation of extraordinary collectible block products for adult brick fans by partnering with exclusive pop culture IPs. So for all of my OCD friends, I am going to be putting each of these in numerical order, and then we will begin. I have a little table right here that you can sort of see. Chinese Paladin, AKA The Legend of Sword and Fairy, was a very popular RPG released in 1995 by a Taiwanese video game company. We've got our little bag of accessories. It later went on to be a very successful live action adventure fantasy drama starting in 2005 and went on for at least five additional series. Okay, that's freaking cute. And they even have a brick remover. We're very appreciative of these. The story follows the Zhao Yao, the protagonist of the game, who is an orphan who lives with his aunt Li in a small fishing village in China. When his aunt falls sick, he travels across the sea to a mystical island in search of a cure for her. He meets a maiden, Zhao Linger, whom he falls in love with, and the story goes on to include forced marriages, memory loss, a maiden in need of rescuing, murder, and long lost family. is the back of the computer. Look at how cute this is. The details with the fan and the screws and the back ports. And then there's the inside where the PCB will go. And this video is brought to you by our sponsors, PCB Way, where you can get PCBs starting at $5. And as we all know, PCB stands for Pantasy's Cool Bricks, doesn't it? And that is the nice clean finished back. Very, very, very cute. Big fan. So that is the end of bag one. Now we're gonna start on one of the sets. So we're gonna set this guy aside.
Thank you. I appreciate you. Enjoy my nuts. All right, Jip Tippers, we are officially done with the first book. We have our little peekaboo scene inside here, and we've got our other one. Oh, and then when we slide out this side compartment, we've got this scene right here. There's a little sword out of, and there we go. All right. Now we are going to start on the second book, and that should be the monitor. So here we are going to be using bags 5 through 10, and I will organize them just like I did before.
Wow. So it is, it is inside. Okay, we'll do the reveal later. So right now we're working on the keyboard and as you can see, it has the foundation of a PCB, which I think is so stinking cute. Look at how cute this is. <laughs> okay. There we go, took a few tries, but that's pretty good. Here we have the disc. Pretty. We have plugged in our monitor. Here is our mouse. We are going to plug in our mouse. Here we have our keyboard. mouse pad. There's 
use the keyboard. Okay, so here is the finished Windows 98 PC brick build. It's incredible. I have the full keyboard. Underneath it has the PCB. Way. A mouse with a right and a left button. Does it doesn't it, work? it doesn't click, but um, it looks adorable. I used to work in a uh, Lego computer store, but I couldn't click with the customers. Sorry, carry on. Uh, so it's what terrible. we can do is we can load the game. So what? here is the game cartridge with the disc. That's a CD. It is. So pull looks up like the CD. A, looks like a crystal. Wow. I actually really like that. I know. I, I did too. Um, put it in the, I always do this. So put it in the CD in drive. The CD drive. Yeah. Don't touch the bottom, get fingerprints on yeah. it. Yeah. And then it, see, it's got an actual working. And then you can put in a save disc. Uh, I'll let you into a secret. I was playing with these earlier. Right. So I love, not in there, but just, I love the little slab of yellow plastic. They just look cute. I'm going to put in a blue one. You know, you got to save your, and there is a button to remove it, but I pushed it too hard. So now it's stuck. So that's fine. So that now we're loading the game. Here comes the aspects of the game. You have this scene right here, which I can actually pull out. So you have this scene. So now I understand what, how it plays the game. Yeah. In, in real life, in, in the computer. Yeah. So there she is at a waterfall as she falls. Wait, where's her bottom half? Uh, in the water. Hello. Yes. Gentle. <laughs> and then there is this side scene right here where someone is training for combat. Oh, yeah. And is this a, based on a real game? Yeah, a game and also a, um, I always want to call it like a telenovela, but it's a- Anime? It's an, an no, it's a live action um, drama wow. based on the game. So here they're learning to fight. Beautiful. Back. On the back of the monitor, there's this retractable piece. It's crazy. And that is because of Come up. this scene right here. <laughs> where the, I'm pretty sure this is the auntie who is about to hit this person in the head with, with a frying, frying pan. pan. Yes. And then... Faulty town style. It is. And then I can what? unveil this scene <laughs> and put this back inside. And there's actually one more piece that comes straight out, like 3D, yeah. that I have opted out of. I don't blame you at this stage. <laughs> because <laughs> um, I like the, the Windows 98. Yeah. All so the things, but open the lid. This is probably the fastest you've ever loading. installed <laughs> Windows 98. <laughs> Ta -da! Beautiful. But this was so fun. And if you look down here, all the buttons are accurate. You know what I mean? There's power, yeah. there's, you know, contrast. Here you've got the drives. You can literally load a disc in. I was admiring the VGA plug on the back, just the accuracy of it. It's worth it though. Yeah, I had a really good time. Being made of plastic bricks, does it run blockchain technology? Yes. <laughs> Great, so I'll be uh, buying some Bitcoin on Windows 98 later. <laughs> well, that is it for Perifractics Retro. Oh, sorry, it's your show. Sorry. So that is it for Lady Fractics Retro Recipe with a cameo from Perifractic. I want to thank Fantasy so much for sending this to us. I had a really, really good time. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe and support below and cheerio. Wave to the people. <laughs> That's enough. The, the credits are still going, look. Oh. Mm -hmm. All right, then do pig. Don't you call me? I heard that'll do pig. Yes, it's from Babe. Oh.